Alright. I'll take this for a start. Why the fuck not? I like the item. Yes, I'm one of the few people that actually uses this item actively, or at least tries to. I think it's underrated. I mean, just look at how cool it looks at first. Like, come on. How can you not? It's... The reason is the item saved my life before. Oh my fucking... Like, damn. Getting this... Like, I'm getting tech X a lot lately. Thanks, game. I'm not going for boss rush or anything like that, so... It's great that I can fucking, like, give myself the time I need again. Don't have to rush anything. By the way, we are locked onto devil deals now, right? You can't take, like, angel deals are gone for us. You can give me another chest. Damn. I mean, I'm fine with that as long as the devil deals are, you know, good. And cost efficient, right? The reason I have a problem with devil deals, uh, like in opposite position of like angel deals, is just that angel deals don't cost hearts, right? So technically, you're not giving anything up for the angel deal, and that just like makes it infinitely more valuable than devil deals. That's just my personal fucking view on the subject subject was there a key in the shop i didn't look i think well, there wasn't we can get the super secret from here actually the normal one okay magic marsh would have been too fucking good wouldn't it i've not given up yet damn hold on Bombs are key. Wait, that wouldn't have done anything for me. Out. Bombs left. Shit. Doesn't matter though, we got one of the best pill effects that you can get. Turn on down. I like to go uh, to Alt Path on the first floor, reasoning being this is just the extra item. And I can deal at this point, like in the be beginning of Repentance, was kind of fucking hard, I'm not gonna lie, but at this point, I can deal with Alt Path, the first two floors, especially when I have fucking Tech X, obviously. So yeah, please don't be anything bad. That's surprisingly neutral. I respect that game. That was so fucking smooth, goddamn. Seems like we're gonna get this double deal too, so that's gonna be interesting. No, I'm starting to like Tech X again. I know I've said before that I don't like Tech X anymore. Well, it was my favorite item in Afterbirth Plus because of the nerves, but it's still decent, right? It's just not as fucking awesome anymore. Uh, this hits both of them. Dude, game. Do I have Guppy's tail or something like that? What is going on? That's a tears up. Wow, I'm genius. I'm a fortune teller at this point. Uh, yeah. You on the second floor, that's harsh game. I hate this guy on any stage of the game, actually. Got a copy item, a boss item. And we do not get a devil deal. So we get two black cards. Uh, Guppy's head versus Anarchist's cookbook. That's a tough one. 
I like Capri's head, but I also really like Anakin's cookbook. But I think Capri's head is going to be more valuable in terms of damage in the end of the day. See if we can find another key for the shop or maybe the chest. I think going for the shop would be the more rational decision. Not going to be relevant either way, it seems, though. My hopes are up. But probably, hold on. Could be there. I'm going to go into the... I'm going to take a risk here and go into the crystal. room. Never take blind Chris from items, guys. You just saw why. Take blind shop items, though, because those are awesome. Don't play like me, in all honesty, though. Like, just don't. If you watch any player that's really good at the game, like fucking Sin Victor or anything, anybody like that. Huts. Creeds, right? BD1P. What's his name? Like those guys would n not, not, not a single good fucking player would have taken fucking blind item in the curse room. Unless they were feeling really fucking spicy. And the problem with me is that I always feel spicy. Like I always want to go for the risk. Because, like, my brain works in a way where it's like, it always sees high risk as, like, high, high reward. But sometimes you shouldn't take risks. Especially if the risk is too big. Use a condom is what I'm trying to say. Uh, crawl space? That's actually a crawl space. Mm, never mind, it isn't. It just. Glor made it look like that. I mean, I'm killing everything so fast, so Blood Puppy can't really stack up. I mean. And even if he would, I. Yes, I could handle it. You know what? Talking about not taking risks, I'm not gonna take these pills. I'm gonna do as I say for once. <coughs> Actually act, act on the wisdom I spread. Not on the stupidity I call my burden. Stop killing things, blood puppy. Uh, I'm so... I'm so, I'm so glad I made that decision. Um, Actually, no, you know what? I made a noob mistake. I should have gone to the shop first, blown up the fucking, like, uh, keeper, shopkeeper, in order to get, um, fucking, you know what I mean, uh, devil wheel, chance increase. Then I maybe would have gotten it. Can go into the cruise room here. Yes, it is a risk. Oh god damn it, I'm doing it again, am I not? Can it be here? Actually, no, I read about the conditions lately and there was actually something in there that I didn't know yet. 
as far as I remember, but I forgot what it was, so... That's my fucking memory for you all. Always get rid of these guys first, by the way. They're the most annoying. I mean, basically, you should always get rid of their thing in the room first that is the most, like, dangerous to you. And I think that's, like, strongly subjective to everybody. Everybody has a different kind of view on that. But the principle principle stays the same basically. Uh, I have the light now. And the serpent's kiss, huh? That's a luck up and an HP up, I guess, like... What the fuck was that? You saw that flash of light right there? Yeah, I have no idea either what the fuck that was, but... Nice game, thanks. Looked cool. I mean, this... Like, doing the boss on this side kinda worked out. Oh! Also, Serpent's Kiss works very well uh, with Perfection, which is actually something I forgot to mention. Or oh, forgot to realize, even. Now, I'm gonna hope for something which is highly unlikely. But the chances, the chance is there. God damn it. Well, I said highly unlikely. Here, I want to. Uh, I have enough bombs, so I can. I want to look for them right now. Probably adjacent to this room, right? Uh, you know what? Sometimes it's just better to let go. Because actually, I forgot about the fact that. Really? That just fucking happened, huh? Uh, I forgot about the fact that I actually need two bombs for this. So, and uh, good that I didn't look any further for the secret rooms. We got the knife piece. There's nothing I forgot. Let's head on now. Although it's weird that I'm saying this having tech X, but damage would be actually nice. And the fucking guppy spiders or it uh, flies. <laughs> guppy spiders, exactly. Brain, you had your fucking coffee, what's going on? The thing that I actually really need though is movement speed. Not gonna lie. Movement speed would be awesome. What? Blood pot P. I'll give it to you, bro. I need to pay attention. I'm not used to paying attention to Blood Pot P. So that's why I'm a bit scared right now. Don't want to lose track of his like transformation process. Okay, he's still a good boy. Stop giving me fucking golden chests for fucking like hinted rocks, I swear again. It's not helpful at all if I don't have any keys. This is, yeah, this is mine's one. Nice, thanks game. Actually what I asked for, thanks game. And you being nice. I said nothing. Deck X is literally so fucking bad against this guy just because I don't have a lot of like... Y you see what I mean, right? 
like the the tech X shots that don't have a lot of contact with him because he's li right like to the wall opposite of me and I can't get in a position where actually I can hold on ah, I guess that kind of works but, well there goes my perfection <laughs> That's fine, we got a soul heart. That actually didn't hit me. Uh I'll rewatch that, I don't actually understand what hit me there. Another HP up right next to a devil deal. Uh spectral tears. Does that Anything for Tech X? I don't think it does, right? I just picked up a completely useless thing. Whatever. I never liked having too much red health either way. Pick this up. Once again, I didn't do as I said. Like, oh, wow. What? Hold on a second, what? How the fuck did he hit me like that from that angle? Hold on a second. This is highly unlikely again. I'm just always hoping for stuff like that because it, it would be nice, right? What about this one? Eh. Also highly unlikely. Uh, I'm actually wa almost 100% certain it's uh, next to this room right here. Or down. Wow. Honestly, Blood Puppy saved me a lot of trouble right there, I guess. Thinking about how often I've been fucked by fucking Curse of the Blind by now. I happily take that so I can revert a terrible mistake if I have to. Good pill effects. I take that any day of the week. Uh, that didn't help a lot, I'm not gonna be honest with you, but... Set on down, I should have picked up that fucking heart, whatever. Ash pit. <laughs> More like ass pit. Please, Loch. I can't do it. How the fuck did Blood Puppy not transform yet? He must be about to red. Ah, goddammit, I ran into that one, huh? <laughs> Telling you. Hourglass is underrated. Okay, that is just highly unfair. Fuck you, game. Let's do something else with the hourglass. Yeah, yeah, that's kind of worth it. The key is key's nice. A half art. I 
I literally did not have the DPS to like prevent that from happening. And you know what? That's completely fine because I can just try again at this time. I reacted fast enough. Also, we now know that Blood Puppy is like one enemy away from transforming, so... Damn, he fast. And he's back to cute again. Does Blood Puppy actually deal damage, like in terms of killing bosses and stuff like that? Or is he just like, leech? Leech doesn't deal a lot of damage, I think, so... Because if he deals more, or like a good amount, it might be worth picking up, actually. Any interaction from that? Probably not. God damn it. Did you find the shop yet? No, it did not. Uh. Hey. Oh, it's you. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I didn't hit anything with that. God, I love having this much of a range advantage, to be honest. That feels good. Did not get the devil deal. It's completely fine though. Got the damage up and... Now... Let's do this. Imagine if Blood Puppy followed us here. That would be fun, wouldn't it? <coughs> nice voice crack right there, by the way. God, I think I'm so out of practice for the fucking mother fight. I'm gonna do my best though. It's always like, if I don't do the mother fight, like for three days or something like that, I'm just horrible at it. I just need to get that shit memorized like once and for all. Like, I feel like most people have already gotten so used to it. Play bitch. I thought I messed up bad there. Hey, but we got out of it without taking damage, so that's good. I'm always a bit quiet in that part of the game just because I really need to like focus up, think about my dodges, dodges and stuff. Oh, 
And we have the glowing hourglass. See, take it out. And if it wouldn't, uh, like if it didn't pay out, we could have still used the glowing out. That's right. So. Hold on a second, it might actually be here. Okay, I'm like my super secret, like my secret room finding skills today are like not existent. I'm sucking a dick if it's here. God fucking damn it. Who's up? Ah, I hate myself for saying that. The normal secret room can't be there. Ah, fuck it. Ah, let's head on down. God, I love being for. Oh, fuck you, game. I was about to say uh, is that I'm, I love like being forced to giving up HP. Just to like play the game further. It's just incredible. Uh. I swear, before I understood how these guys work, they fucked me over so bad every single fucking time. Because I just did not understand at all. Like, please not enemies. Thanks. <laughs> uh, this room is fun. Could be here actually. I actually know we just found it. I'm an idiot. Actually, f fuck this room. What? You did not die? If I hit like with the corner of my shot or like the edge of the fucking Tech X shot, it actually deals a lot of damage. No, I can't. I absolutely. I know I lied. Fuck this room, though. I could actually try that again. Honestly, fuck Gihanna in general. Like, look at these rooms, dude. What the fuck is wrong? Oh, do I. Will I do it? Actually, yeah, because. Uh, sacrifice. Uh, because going hourglass, I can just try for free, and if it doesn't go well, well, I can just. Rewind. Alright, that didn't pay out. Who? Ah. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. Don't question how the fuck I didn't get hit there, I don't know. Either. Black heart. We got a decent amount of damage now, so at least that's nice. I have so many bombs, let's just try this. Thatch. I'm depressed. Um. Without my morning coffee, I would have died in that room right there. <laughs> Just saying, like, that was all the fucking coffee right there. That's why you that's why you drink your fucking morning coffee, guys. Bit late, bit late for that, but 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 That's exactly by the way why you go into the shop before the item room. And also mostly before the boss, but I'm not perfect. That's not what I... <laughs> Glowing hourglass is fucking good. Damn. Okay. So we got that done. Down. Please not Curse of the Lost again, thanks. Uh, I hate that shit so much. They charge up so fucking fast, like you have so little time to react, it almost always makes me panic. Like it's a fucking miracle that I haven't gotten hit by those guys yet. Ah, uh, fuck me. <laughs> like the worst fucking hit I've ever taken. Also kind of the funniest. I just wasn't fast enough, fuck me. Literally glowing hourglass, I don't know if you've ever played League of Legends, but there is like a champion in there that is so fucking annoying. His name is Echo, right? And what he does, like with his ultimate, he just rewinds basically a few seconds back to a point where he stood before basically, and he like recovers all his HP and stuff, like to the point where he was like at an HP, at, like to the time he teleports back basically, right? And that shit is exactly what this is like. Like, oh no, I made a terrible mistake, I died, I'm just gonna rewind. Pretty full HP again. Literally a free get out of jail free card. A free get out of jail free card. You are smart. I'm so fucking smart, am I not? But you know what I mean, right? That shit gets, it got me furious when I played the game. It, it's, well, it was so fucking annoying. Oh no, I got fucking outplayed and literally like dunked on. Or, oh yeah, now I win the fight because fuck you, that's why. All the fucking time, all the goddamn time, I tell you. Holy water is amazing. By the way, if you didn't know. I should have used the glowing hourglass there and then like re-rolled holy water to see if we, uh, like if we would have gotten anything crazy. Can I get you over here so you don't trigger when I take this? And if not just use the glowing hourglass, go in there again and just take holy water that time. That would have been the best play there. 
unfortunately I didn't think of it that time. Black Candle, even though we only have like two floors left, is really fucking good. I'm literally playing fucking Echo. I know you guys hate me talking about League of Legends because the game is horrible, but it kinda is like that. I am going to use that after we're done with this floor. That's uh, like uh, basically forget me not the pill, you know. Oh, not not. Is it forget me not? Am I confusing things again? You know the blue pill, right? The only reason I'm doing stuff like this is the glowing hourglass, by the way, I would never do this like without that. Are you sure? Okay. Now, where is that boss at? I hate this room. Open one chest at a time, for that reason right there. Because if you spawn too many troll bombs, well, you can imagine. Wow, not like a single even decent thing in there, I'm surprised. I mean, no, nah, honestly, I'm fucking impressed, game. Hold on a second. I misplaced it, didn't I? <coughs> ah, who cares? It's it it, it isn't there. I'm almost one hundred percent certain it isn't there. Why am I doing this? I have full HP. God damn it. Close game, but not close enough. Mm. I mean, both Bamboo and Void are not really items I'm considering taking, so... Fuck off. Honestly, shielded tears. Is that delirious? That is delirious indeed. Shielded tears with Tech X should be fucking awesome against Mother F, especially. Uh, oh, yeah. I have such immense trash, trust is trash is <laughs> issues with fucking uh, spike rocks. It's incredible. Mm -hmm. Not only spike rocks, spikes in general. Those things are devils. I tell you. Ok, 
Okay, I hate this room with a fucking passion. Can the game give me something else except fucking like uh tag X for the thumbnail? Trying to generate clicks on this fucking channel that doesn't happen in the game. Gotta give me something. I'm greedy. I think tag X actually makes for a good thumbnail alone, almost. I'm doing it again. Three, four, five, six, that's amazing, seven, uh, Google, Where the fuck is that item? Redemption. Every time you enter a devil room and choose not to take an item, you get one you get plus one damage up upon entering the next throw. The effect is shown via a cross above Isaac's head. Taking a devil deal breaks the cross and prevents the damage up next floor. Taking free pickups such as black hats in the devil deal also counts. Ah Yeah, 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 okay, I'm fine. I got angel deal chance. It's kind of the thing I wanted, so whatever. That actually worked out pretty well. I got I have to admit it. Sacrifice rooms are so unbelievably like underrated, it's crazy. By the way. It's funny that that thing can still hit you theoretically even if you have pressed the button. Repentance for you right there. You should always kill the fat ones first, in my opinion, because like uh, the little ones are literally way easier to deal with on their own. The fat ones are. Oh, holy water procs on. I mean, of course it does. He's considered an enemy, right? That's nice. Are we ready for this? I mean, I, I'm me mentally speaking, I'm never ready for this fight, literally. Also, never prepared because it's just so fucking chaotic. It's crazy. I, but, but I gotta say, I'm proud of myself for how I handled that. Pretty well. Ah, Shield of Tears actually works, okay. Would you look at that? Woohoo! Close right there. Well, let's head on down. No angel deal, by the way, I'm pissed. I was so hyped and now it just game just goes like nah bitch. Fun. Uh -uh. Would be nice if redemption like gave you the fucking uh, damage up if like you don't get the devil deal at all. Did no. Just literally, just no. I 
I am gonna put glowing hourglass into the fucking thumbnail because that shit is mwah. Actually a fucking S tier fucking like spacebar item. Ah uh, that item is good, it blocks a lot of tears. In my opinion, it is very good. Indeed. I mean, any orbital basically is good, right? Hold on a second. Oh, come on. Game. I'm not getting so many fucking trinkets out of this shit. A lot of good ones in there too, huh? See if we can get like something like curved horn. Joker. Joker. That is good though. I think I'm gonna take it that into the mother fight. Oh my fucking god, we got another S tier. Uh is it S tier? Kinda is very good. I'm got I'm not gonna lie to you. I kinda really like that item. And I wanted the two of hearts. And yeah, the wooden cross. Exactly. I really like the crystal ball. It's just that, like, glowing hourglass has done so much for me, right? Like, in this run. And I think I can, like, it will help me with the mother fight. If I take too much damage or stuff like that, I can just go... And try it again. If there isn't an R key in their game, you gay. Fucking like, I can I say that word on? Probably not. Even if I'm like, my one well, myself, I can't say it. I think. But you know the word I was talking about. Yes, daddy. Why the fuck did I say that? Oh, I'm so fucking weird. Stop it! Blood puppy! Bad... Dog? I mean, puppy kinda means dog, right? Oh, you are still in that form! Actually, no, I'm gonna... Wait, that's... Different than before. The fuck? I mean, I don't mind because this one's way easier, but.
So those kind of rooms change up if you go out of them. Okay, that's... It can't be there. Brain function. You've done it before sometimes. Maybe a few years ago. I think spamming uh, revelation, uh, like tech X here, is actually better than charging up revelations. Uh, actually, ah, I don't know. That's why I'm just spamming. Uh. You know why glowing hour class is great? Because if the game just decides to fuck you... You can do this? I would have been un... Like, if that happened and I didn't have glowing hour class, I would have gone on a fucking two hour rant about it. Like, I would have talked about that shit for the next two fucking videos. You can be sure of that. I do not forgive something like that. You have my permission to die. Well, I got a damage up. Use this once, it gives me a health up. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. But this just adds to my fucking argument that Chaos is like fucking S tier without question. I Like I literally got fucking revelations from a golden chest. Like what more proof do you want? Yes, it can mess up your angel deals, your devil deals, right? But like you get so many other items and those items just have the chance to be fucking... Uh, Like uh, angel deal items or devil deal items or like any secret room items even, right? The fact that you can could theoretically get uh, our key out of the boss fight, you know, like think about that for a second. That's crazy. We found the boss room so quickly. Holy shit. It's like the one attack in the first phase that I've, like, whatever, not even gonna... We all know how much bullshit this fight is, I don't have to fucking further elaborate. Feel that you're doing a great job here.
I did not see those fucking indicators there, right? I'm playing like a fucking idiot. I, I told you about how bad I was in this fight. It's always so fucking close. <laughs> Damn, I got three fucking achievements for that. Bloody ghost. Wait, hold on a second. Let's fucking go. Uh, great run, I gotta say. I like. I can't complain. I can't be like, oh, this run was so fucking awesome. It was a great run. Uh, I'm gonna end the video here. If you enjoyed watching, sub subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good one.